Should I have done my nails before this? I don't think so. Guess what, you guys? Boxes! I'm not wearing any pants. Welcome to my channel. I know I said. And I do need like small boxes, but I want them to have like draws. But I also said. 30 euros. I will never. Money won over comfort. So if Marie Kondo taught me anything, it's you need smaller boxes inside your boxes to organize your bigger boxes. But I thought I'd just start out with cosmetics because I do have quite a lot of shit. So these are Nature Republic cheap masks and I bought them in Seoul last year and I bought 500-ish. <laughs> I bought a lot. So I tried to organize them in this um, box here because they take up a lot of space. Actually, I just have them like loose in uh, my cupboard and I cannot have this anymore they take it you know actually they took my um, underwear space so my underwear currently is uh, just in the laundry room laying about somewhere um, where my uh, sheet masks have it cozy in my cupboard so um, this needs to change so we have tomato we have olive and we have orange in the first package. So what I'm going to do is I put them behind each other. When the type changes, I will put them up like so, so you can always tell. This is where the new sheet mask starts. Then we do have chamomile, avocado, and bamboo. In all honesty, I used to be like a Tony Moly guy, but I really switched up. When I went to Hawaii, I went to Nature Republic with a friend, and um, they had like an offer. It's like buy 10, get 10 free sheet masks. <laughs> and um, this is where I first bought Nature Republic, and I do have to say, I do prefer them over the Tony Moly, even though they're hard to get in Germany at least, because we don't have Nature Republic here. We do have Tony Moly in some stores. The next batch, green tea, shea, shea butter, shea butter, shea butter, and royal jelly, which is my absolute favorite. Royal jelly is the shit. And when I bought the box, I kind of thought that they would fit better. So we'll have to see if I can keep them in here. The, the box is higher than I anticipated. You know, like the, 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 the um, border, so like really high actually. So speaking of Tony Moly, I do have... <gasps> oh no, no, I have more Nature Republic of what I'm doing. So the next batch is Rose, which is really nice, but it gives me pimples aloe. Tea tree. You can tell which ones I prefer. If I were to buy as many again, I would just, you know, do the same. It's, it's nice to have like the selection so you can choose which ones you want and which ones you don't. But they have some loose ones flying about. This one goes here. Camomile! Camomile! Ah, so this one goes here. There. Then one more aloe. Aloe goes here. I do have some Tony Moly snail. Which also, I bought a hundred. I bought a hundred of these. You know, they, they have like those really crazy offers and it's just like, you'd be crazy not to buy, you know? Oh, doesn't this feel organized? So one more thing in terms of like sheet thingies, it's these Etude House eye patches that I love. I'm not sure if they're actually working, but every time I use them, I feel really um, moisturized. Like my, my skin looks, well, I guess it looks okay. Um, but it's more about the feeling. So I will leave my beauty for now because I have all the other stuff upstairs and this is quite a challenge. Futile attempt. So I will go on with my babies. This. This is what I'm using now. And at the time it felt like the best idea ever, but then I started to buy more things. It's like when you go to Japan or go to Korea, you kind of have to buy things. I mean, at some point you do have everything, but there will always be this one collection, this one seasonal thing you don't have. Oh no! So you can tell we have a smaller box here. So I do have a lot of things, tapes. So I'm collecting Didakuma everything actually. And I used to collect Didakuma duct tape.
Do the club picnic was a series I really appreciated. I thought this was like really cute. Actually, most things before they introduced Koguma were like amazing. I freaking hate Koguma. He can go and die. It's like a really classic design with the um, yellow and like the poses he takes. Shimashima, which was amazing. Shimashima was like really cute. The reason why I don't have more of these is they kind of stopped producing them. Like every time I go, I can't find them because everything in Japan um, became masking tape, maste, which is okay. I don't like the texture. I don't like the papery feel of it. So I did buy some masking tapes. Um, also, the size is different. I like that these um, are like a bigger size. They're like, I don't know, like nice to look at and nice to handle. Masking tape is like really papery. Um, it's not shiny. It's always like a matte finish. So this is the uh, Didakuma masking tape, which I bought at Didakuma Sabo in Kyoto. So there's a Didakuma um, cafe in Arashiyama and they serve actually really nice food and they have some limited items. Everything is uh, themed honey. It's hard to tell the design. It's like traditional Japanese-ish like kimono type of designs. So I bought two of these. I bought this at Didakuma Town in Osaka. Didakuma Town was like a special event they held for Didakuma's birthday. Again, it's like hard to tell the design of this and I do blame the masking tape texture, also the size, as I said. But this one's really cute because it comes in um, this packaging. So I, honestly, I feel like they're not meant to be used. It's just like, it's so nice to look at. They're so cute. So let me put them here. Also what they had in Arashiyama were those Q-tips which I will never use, um, but they're also really nice to have. So I will just put them here. I don't think they will stay here, but I just put them there. So I do collect um, band-aids too. I do use them sometimes. I also give them to my friends sometimes. I made a mess. I feel like there are some missing. I, I, I don't know, I'm, I'm not blaming anybody, but if you, if you took them, random person that never came to my house, please return them. So I do have the Dirakuma Yellow Edition. Um, in recent years, Dirakuma has like uh, collaborations with public transport in Japan, and um, this was one of them actually. Then I do have this one, which I bought in Korea, and I didn't get it for the design. I only got it because it was the first time I ever saw Dirakuma in a Hangul, and was like not weird, but I found it to be quite special. So I got this one. Also, I bought these uh, Daiso in Korea. These are Cacao Friends. So I'm kind of pondering if I should keep um, Nidakuma separate from like other brands, other characters. For, for, okay, let, let me put these aside for now. So we do Nidakuma first. Then I got these, also Daiso. Really cheap, really cheap. So why not buy them? These are maybe for usage, you know? These I can use, they're like not expensive per se. Again, Daiso Korea. And one more cacao friends. I kind of got into cacao friends too, especially Ryan. I mean, who, who doesn't like Ryan? Basic bitch, Didakuma, classic design, which feels kind of empty, so I might have used them actually. This is my all time favorite series of Didakuma. It's a space series, which I missed because I was in Germany when it came out. Those were the most amazing designs. I loved the theme, everything was super, super cute. See, isn't that cute? I'm like, ugh, it's so cute. And they're still all inside, so I didn't use any. Yay! Yay for collectors! And for good measure, I bought um, Guritama ones. And they feel super empty, so. Well, there's one sheet left, so I, I don't know what I did with the other one, but um, there you go, Guritama. When I put them up straight, they're kind of too high, so if I want to put on the top on the box, they have to go sideways, probably. So let me just put them like so. 
the mask in here. Okay, so I was collecting tissues while I still am. They make great gifts because people think they're like really cute. So every time I give one of these to my friends, they feel like they can't use them because they're just too cute. They usually come in um, larger packages. So you have one big package and this big package holds like six or eight of these. So that's why I have a double of this one. And you can kind of tell by the colorways which ones were in the same package. Kodirakuma playing with his Adirakuma toy. So cute. See another double. He's from the Sweets series. They're like really cute too. And also here, Sweets collection. This is also like a classic design. Also this. Mm -hmm. Yes. And Oh, I was obsessed with Q when it came out in Germany, we don't have it anymore. And at that time, when I went to Japan, it was still around. Readily available around type of thing, where you had like different flavors. Now it's kind of rare in Japan too, but I did like him a lot, so I do have a lot of bottles. And uh, this one here, one more Q. Well, actually it says Q, Q. But I, I don't know, Q, Q sounds like that. So I will put these in a different box inside my box. So I always keep the boxes I get from purchases because First of all, I'm obviously crazy and keep everything, but second of all, they will come in handy at some point, like now. Great. Ah, oh, they don't fit. Look, it's way too big. I don't like that. And if I put them sideways, can I, can I put... Oh no! Ugh, wait. Oh, see, I can put them in here. This, this is like the perfect size. So I put the doubles first, and then I also put the coup um, inside. And I was contemplating um, separating brands, but I only have two coup, and it would be crazy to put this somewhere else. So I just keep them here, and this fits really nicely nowhere. Great. Since I'm a crazy collector of uh, things Dirakuma, I do have Ziploc bags. When I saw them online, because I do haunt the Dirakuma website religiously, I just flipped. I do need these. And of course, I have doubles. I used one. I also used one to give to other people and they're like crazy popular with everybody. I mean, everybody loves Dirakuma. Even, every time when you introduce somebody to uh, Dirakuma, they just fall in love. I mean, how could you not? How could you not? They're too high for the box. <laughs> this kills me. And I don't want to put them flat because this I, 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 I will not put them flat. Last thing about these, they're from the current collection. I think they kind of stick with this one because there are still designs around for this series. Wow, how well nothing fits inside here. Wait. I will, I will manage somehow, I mean, why, why will this not work? I don't know, you know, sometimes, mm -mm, no, mm -mm -mm. <gasps> um, thoughts and prayers, thoughts and prayers. So what I will do is put these up like so, since I cannot close this box anyways, I can just keep them like so. Why will nothing work? I don't know if this is like, is it a curse? Is it because I was too cheap to buy Muji? Wait, you know what? This kind of makes sense, like so. Kind of, sort of. I do have more Ziploc. These from Blind Friends, which I actually love and I do use them. I mean, they're, they're, they're dear to me, but I think I bought a second pack and it should be around somewhere. And you know, they're like really great. I use them for traveling. Um, I actually put grapes in them when I travel. Oh no, it doesn't fit. Uh, oh no. Okay, so these also go here as well. You know what? But this is... Uh, should I put them somewhere else because it's lying? I will. I also have these Ziploc bags, which are really cute. But I will put these in a different box. But this Didakuma box is killing me. Actually, I do have summer tape. So I also have this design here, which is amazing. It's somewhere in between 
masking tape and reveal duct tape. People do ask me if I made this myself all the time, which I think is crazy and um, deserves no answer. I also have these two, which I bought at Loft, when Loft still had tape. Loft, Loft has been consumed by masking tape. Like, the masking tape craze in Japan is uh, crazy. But I do use them a lot on, well, gift wrap. So let me put them in here, because I, f I feel like, why not, you know? This is crazy, can I put them here? Look, I think I really want to separate the Lidakuma from everything else. So I will not put them inside. So what I also have is this one here. They have, like, crazy ideas how to use these, but the fact of the matter is that they don't stick well at all. So you kind of can put them somewhere and just rip them off again with no traces or problems. They're like really cute and I did like this collection a lot. I didn't like the products as much this time around, but I got this anyways. Oh girl! Let's see what I got. I forgot these. So I have this is from the birthday collection, Girakuma Masking Tape. And this is, this was limited to Ikebukuro. It's really cute and has like the owl. But I will put it back in its plastic because I'm that person. Marie Kondo helped me. Do I need another box for these masking tapes? They're like really uneven in size and shape. So maybe, maybe, maybe. Ah, look, look at that. Go, you go there. Maybe I'll just throw them. Up. No, this is crazy. Marie Kondo will come for me. I do have more things upstairs. I'll be right back. Guess what? More boxes! Also, I found this pin. I know it sounds crazy. I'm like, I found this, I found this, but I kind of, you saw the way I had things before. It's like really hard to tell what you own and what you don't own if everything just, you know, like piles on. Still not Muji compartment. So what I think I'll do for the masking tape is use this small MS box, even though it doesn't seem to fit too well into everything else. Let's, let me, let's just see what happens. I feel better like this. Maybe this one will fit too? Let's see. Well, it was worth a try, but the question remains where to put these. You know what? Maybe I was maybe I was stupid to put the tape in this direction. Let me put the tape in another direction. Let's put the tape... Oh my gosh, do you see this? Oh my gosh. But you know what? Now I have I, I, I do have space to put these ones in here too. So let's let's just I'm sorry gods of the Dakuma. Maybe maybe it's better I have all tapes together. Let's see for the ziplocks. Okay, you know what? They go in nicely, but the thing is, those won't be the last ones I will buy, so um, maybe I have to rethink what I'm doing. Well, this one fits in here. You know what I forgot, though? Package. <gasps> I have to put it back in the package! So I do have Usamaru masking tape, which I bought at the line store, and it's really cute. And I think this will also go with the Dirakumas. Okay, newsflash, it doesn't fit. As for band-aids, they also come in these packages, like regular stickers. So I do have a lot of these too. And I think I will put them with the tape, the tissues, and the other band-aids, rather than putting them with the stickers. Okay, so it's good news. I wasn't crazy. I do have more band-aids, but they're all in this shape. So I messed up. I don't have them in the pack. They all have them in this sticker packaging. So this one is also from the picnic series. Do I need do I need another box for this? There's no box to size, so um, let's just pretend. This one I also loved, Strawberry. The Strawberry series was like really cute. There was this one Didakuma who had like a strawberry hat and I just went crazy for that. Paris was also kind of a cute series, I think.
I bought this one just because I'm a collector, but I do friggin um, despise pandas and this is not cute at all, so yes. This is more of a classic design yet again, like the polka dots and the shima shima the stripes. And I do love baby blue. Baby blue is like a nice color. We have this from the sweet series. And they're sparkly, like a lot of them are sparkly. I know it's hard to tell, they are sparkly. Some more sparklies. Some more sweets. Usually there's um, two sheets of stickers in one pack. I tend to use doubles or gift them to friends. Okay, this is kind of edgy, like the face series, where it's just like the faces. So I also do have some sumiko. And I have one jinbe. But I will not put them with a Didakuma stuff because I will lose sight. I think it's better like that. So I will put them with um, other brands and some miscellaneous. Because I only have one Jimbe and they don't have too much um, Sumiko, so I'll put them separate. But you know what? I think that will be it for the first box. Oh, who decided to come out again? It's the Sun Fuck You. Thanks for watching me um, filling my first box. I do have two more to go plus the cosmetics. I think I might have two little boxes for too much shit, but we will see how this works out. I mean, I can always go and buy. No, I actually can't. Um, so fingers crossed that everything works out. I will show you the final results in my room if I ever manage to get uh, rid of everything. So thank you. Bye. <laughs> Subscribe.